take an absurd premise and prove it with rigorous logic. I just saw something, was watching something that came up and it's got Jerry Seinfeld on the, on the Charlie Rose show. And uh, he used to play on PBS. I thought it was a good show. Excellent interview with Russell Crowe on the movie Cinderella Man, along with, uh, oh, jeez, Paul Diamati. But I see this thing, and that's what Jerry was talking about with comedy. Take an absurd premise and prove it with rigorous logic. And it made me think of that poor guy over there. That poor guy. I'm not going to say that what he's done is comedy. I'm not going to say it's the opposite of comedy. Maybe, maybe I'll say that. We'll see how it goes. But, uh... It's like taking an absurd premise and proving it with logic. You immediately want to say what that poor guy has done. He's taken an absurd premise, as a premise, and he's proving it with absurd illogic. But that's not, I, I won't go that far either. Because the thing is, there's some of the things that, are, that they're all out there saying and going crazy over there that are throwing up in the air and they're saying, look at this, look at this, look at this. And I go, oh. The same things I was kind of thinking and even saying before I saw how it could all go wrong. And I'm like, I need to rethink the way I'm thinking about a few things because this is absolute madness. And, and I still do agree with some, but a much lower level because we're seeing how it does or doesn't work when it's all thrown out right into the air. Ah, I'm breathing this shit. Mm. Be better off if I could grow gills. That way I could sit here all day and do what my dad said, getting looped to the gills. Mm. It's not comedy. Taking an absurd premise and proving it illogically to a certain degree. It's not the opposite of proving it with a rigorous logic. It's not proving it rigorously illogical. It's not just the opposite. What happens is, even though it's not the opposite, it's on that spectrum. And, uh, we're seeing the opposite opposite of fun, good humor, funny, when it's taken to that extent. What we see is a very treacherous, angry culture closing the door on what we remember of what little freedom we 